Hi there, I'm going to show you how to do PCA really quickly, really easily on the program called BioWinG. So it's a free program. You can uh, go to the website BioWinG and you can download them for free. Um, well, it's a more like a trial uh, phase and have some limitations. You can like, try now and log in and uh, register for that. But once you download them, you can just open them up it looks like this It'll take a little while it might ask you to lock in that's okay and you can start the new work set when you're ready so but how to prepare data so I use this data example so I this is a uh, the iris data that we use in our class as well let me go back to that lecture so this is species of three species of iris they have about 50 flower each and they measure sepal length sepal width petal length and petal width each of them and have this number and you can do use this to do pca that's it this is how you prepare data save in excel you be you're done all right so we have this as excel and we just open a new worksheet and you select the file from your device and i'll pick the one from my desktop the iris oops sorry and then I'll just click create oh does it work no all right I'll do it again so when you can create it asks you what you want to do and what we want to do is here the PCA is part of dimensionality reduction so just click here and you can let them decide for you but this is what we're gonna use the principal component analysis and you can choose like what kind of what color label you want them to generate uh, they can do auto which is not recommended you you already have the column called species this is what you want to separate you should click species here and then you can click run and you can see here it's already show the species based on uh, the pca and you can adjust here a little bit by like have shape by species or so have different shape or you can have size based on colors uh, it doesn't really doesn't really help too much isn't it so the sea pulling isn't the size of the point doesn't vary too much you can do, remove that you can have color by sea pulling which is not really helpful either so you can do whatever you want with it uh, I'm gonna stick with the simplest one you can see there's like watermark here that's a given because you use the free program if you want the watermark gone you have to pay for it it's up to you I don't think you need that so you can edit the plot you can click on the points here and you can change the color to whatever you want it will automatically change color for you you can increase the size you can increase the stroke like the, the circle around it so you can basically like redo your port however you want it to be you can click on this uh, uh, label and increase the size that might be a bit too big you can even change fonts if you want so it's like the possibility is endless so since we already you can even like type more if you want and I'm gonna change to so it's look consistent so you can do a lot of things except remove them uh, uh, remove the label you can even like uh, do the more points more dots on them I can't seem to resize them back 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 I don't want this thing how do I I want to remove that can't no you can make the size bigger you can say so I'm like making a making a fool myself right now so so you can do a lot with it what I'm trying to say you can make this transparent so they can actually label them and you can like 
type is is cool. I can type here. So it's like a lot of possibility you want to do. And once you're done, you can download them as PNG. And it will go to your output on my desktop. It will be easier to see. And you can open the file. And it looks kind of weird because my computer has dark background. So you can use that in your presentation. You can just like copy them to your Word or presentation and it would be ta-da, that's done. That basically the result of your PCA. So that's a quick, the quickest, easiest way, like drag and drop tool for your PCA if you want to do some for your project. So that's completely optional.